Hey folks! Well, I've got this kayak. It's uh, skin on frame and it's seen better days. This was given to me and as you can see it was uh, made by somebody. I actually don't know who. But uh, I've grown to like it over the years. It's very uh, fast, light, a little delicate, but uh, that's life. As you can see, it's seen better days. So what I'd like to do is actually take it apart, fix it up a little bit, and then uh, coat it with Dacron. Make it a little lighter and hopefully uh, maybe it'll last a little longer. Well, here's a dumb move to set me back. I broke my GoPro mount. But it's pretty bad on GoPro. The thing was, uh, it's only connected at two points, very slightly, and not a very good design. Bad on them. Well, I've stripped it, and... Uh, dry rot and as you can see I've got some repairs to do this thing's got some dry rot going on here so I'll probably uh, try to cut this back and make it a little shorter that's my quick fix otherwise uh, Replacing all these pieces is uh, basically re making a new boat. So I'll try to bring it back to uh, maybe here. See if I can bend these, these guys a little more. I could make it a little more narrow. And the front also has issues, as you can see. I don't have to go as far back with this one. I could probably just go to here. Cut it right down here somewhere and get a new piece of wood. Yep, and I'm probably gonna add cross piece here. Cause my feet only go up to here, so that'd be good for me. Well. I didn't want to start this project, but it uh, doesn't look that bad. Here I'm just going over the boat to uh, make a note of where everything is before I take it all apart. If anybody knows where to get the Dacron or the uh, ballistic nylon, or ballistic polyester for this type of boat, please leave it in the comments below. Thank you. Mommy, no ribs. Yes, that's right. This boat has no ribs. It's there's nothing that has to be bent in a steamer or uh, you know bent wood. It's all uh, put together with screws and straight pieces. And okay, the frame has some, but uh, it's you don't need a steamer. Feel it? Can you feel it? The squirrels running around, the braids trying to figure this out. Of course, me with an engineering background, I always want to make things better than they were. You know, improve on the product. Of course, here I'm looking at it. And going, I should add a fish rod. Oh. Well, there we go. Oh, what are you doing here? You visiting? <laughs> yeah. 
yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna start really working on the boat today. Took some days off. And uh, I guess this is the way it was before. It seemed to be on a slight angle. So I'm gonna probably bring it up to here. Let's get away from all this stuff. And I got the saw. So I can do these cuts. I've already removed these cross bracings. And I'm gonna shorten this one as well. Or actually I already shortened that one. Anyway, I'm back at it again. You gotta calm down. Yeah. Well, there's the pack boat in action during my mushroom foraging campaigns on the island on Lake Cama, Quebec. Thanks for watching. Give me a thumbs up and subscribe. Drip on this.